Hello, ladies and gentlemen. It seems that the world impactful medical insights is now trending. And it seems like it is the new name of our medical insights, those medical insights that are generated by the medical science liaisons and the other colleagues in the field medical team to indicate the value and the business impact of these medical insights. In this tutorial, I will share with you the five main criteria of an impactful medical insight. And also I will share with you the capabilities and the skills needed in order to generate impactful medical insights. So let's get started. And as usual, let's start with the definition. What is an impactful medical insight? One, it must be relevant. Two, it must be actionable. Three, it must be accurate. Four, it must be timely. And five, it must be communicable. talk about medical insights and say they are relevant, what do we mean? First, they must be applicable. Applicable to be implemented in the medical field. Two, they must be aligned with the current medical strategy. And three, they must be aligned with the current business strategy. So they must be applicable. They must be aligned with two strategies, the medical strategy and the business strategy. This requires from us as medical and as field medical team to have deep understanding of the strategies. Number two, to be actionable. That means the insight that you generate needs to lead to a specific action. And this action may be internal or external. External, like changing clinical practice, initiating treatment guidelines, or improving patient care through certain initiatives, there must be an action that results from this insight, and that makes it actionable, which is part of being impactful. There is something important when we talk about actionable insight, because you can just write that a meeting needs to happen or we need to put a plan or we need to conduct a study. So these are not really considered actionable insights unless they specify who should do what and when. So when you propose an actionable insight, you need to say in how you write it and how you communicate it, who should do what and what is the time frame of this proposed action. This is very important. The third criteria is to be timely. And to have the timely medical insight means it should be current, okay? So you should not generate insight that is rooted two or three years back. Two important points when we talk about communicating medical insights on time. The routine and formal reporting system of the medical insights. And this, my recommendation is to have it immediately while the information is still fresh after the interaction with the key opinion leaders. The second type of communication is some exceptional communication because of the nature of the insight. Maybe the insight can impact the patient or related to a safety issue or requires immediate attention from senior leadership. In these cases, you need to probably adopt a different approach in communication in addition to the traditional or the ordinary reporting line. Four, it should be accurate. And accurate 
in general means for us as medical to be evidence-based. It must be coming from a reliable source. It must be based on evidence. We need always to link our medical insights to references, evidence-based medicine, and data. Consider here that the decisions in general, not only related to the business strategy or the medical strategies, are made based on data. So if your medical insight is referenced and augmented with evidence or with data, this will definitely make it impactful. A medical insight that is lacking evidence and only dependent on judgment or intuition will not be considered impactful. And the last criteria is it should be communicable. You must be able to communicate it smoothly and accurately. Avoid using complicated jargon. Avoid using the sophisticated medical terminology if you are communicating to a commercial team. Use simple language, be concise, well-rounded in your sentences to communicate and so everybody can understand and you can get the buy-in or your insight. So these are the five criteria for an impactful medical insight. The process of generating medical insights in general and impactful medical insights specifically seems very easy. However, the truth is that it requires a lot of essential skills and capabilities from medical affairs colleagues. Now, from the five criteria that we mentioned about what is an impactful medical insight, let's explore the essential skills and attributes that the field medical team, specifically medical science liaisons, need to excel in this area, in generating impactful insights. First, they have to understand deeply the business acumen, because understanding both the medical and business strategies is crucial, as we mentioned. This knowledge allows them medical science liaisons to bridge the gap between scientific insights and the business goals, ensuring that your contributions align with the overall strategy of the organization. And without this knowledge of business and scientific acumen, your insights will not cross or cover this gap, will not bridge the gap between the science and the business goals, so it will not be impactful. So the only way for your insights to be impactful is to align these insights with the business strategies and goals. Also, from the five criteria of the impactful insights, we learned that we need to generate meaningful insights that are relevant and applicable. That means that we need to plan so planning skills and effective planning are keys to successful key opinion leader engagements. Medical science liaisons must plan their interaction, knowing exactly which question to ask in order to elicit specific types of insights. So we don't go to the key opinion leaders in order to fish for insights, but according to our planning and according to our strategy, we prepare the questions that we need to ask in order to trigger the, the answers that we are looking to have. The strategic questioning helps in gathering more valuable information about the topic, and that can drive the meaningful outcome, and that's how your insights will be relevant and meaningful. Another important area that we don't need to stress on is the scientific acumen. Mastering evidence-based medicine, hierarchy of evidence, and also data-driven decision-making is fundamental to the process of key opinion leader engagements because you generate meaningful, impactful insights that are expected to impact the business strategies and goals. So medical science liaisons 
need to have a deep understanding of the scientific literature and clinical data to provide credible and impactful insights. Another very important area of skills and capabilities is the communication skills. Clear and effective communication is very essential to convey the complex scientific information in order to communicate this to a diverse base of audience. Whether you are interacting with key opinion leaders or internal stakeholders or healthcare professionals, strong communication skills ensure your message is understood and valued. Finally, and the most important, I think, strategic thinking. Strategic thinking ties all these skills together. It involves anticipating trends, aligning activities with long-term goals, and innovating to stay ahead. And it, has, it plays a very important role in the planning for the key opinion leader engagements. Strategic thinking enables medical science liaisons and field medical teams to make informed decisions when it comes to filtering and analyzing their data and their insights. And it enables them as well to make informed decision that can contribute to the success of the entire medical affairs and the organization. So these are the main categories of capabilities that are needed just to generate meaningful insights. Business acumen, scientific acumen, strategic thinking, communication skills, and planning skills. That's it regarding the five criteria of the impactful medical insights and the skills and capabilities needed in order to be able to generate impactful medical insights. I hope that the next time you sit down to generate medical insights, you think of these five criteria because they will definitely change the way you write and communicate your medical insights. Thank you very much and have a nice day.